How's it going? So last week, my neighbor had this six horsepower Brinkton Stratton pressure washer sitting in the alley for free. So what I'm gonna do is tear it down, pull off the carb, take out the spark plug, and uh, see if we can get this thing going. Let's get started. So now that we got all the gunk cleaned off the frame of the pressure washer, we're going to do two things. Check if the engine's locked up and then we are going to check to see if we have spark. So the easiest way to tell if the engine is locked up or not is to just simply pull the recoil. So we know that the engine is not locked up because the piston moves up and down freely. And if it was locked up, uh, you couldn't pull that thing. Now it's stuck. So now what we're going to do is check for spark. Simplest way to do that is you're going to pull your boot off your spark plug. And also, just a tip: make sure this is the for this engine style. This is your dead man. So it says, as the rabbit for fast, turtle for slow, and the stop for obviously stopped engine. If this is in the stop position, you won't get any spark. So what you want to do is go up to the turtle so you know that it's not in the stop position. And you're going to take your spark plug off, which is surprisingly loose. And now you're going to take your spark plug, put it in your boot. And then what I like to do is just get an extra little piece of insulation because if you don't, it will shock you once in a while, and I've learned it the hard way. You can feel fine if you're touching the boot, but um, it can happen. So anyways, now what I'm going to do is put the end of the spark plug on an unpainted part of the engine, and usually that's just the fins right on the head. You can do that. And I'm going to pull the recoil and watch the spark plug at the same time. If I see spark, we know we got spark. If we don't, then we don't have spark. So we have spark, which is a great thing. So next step is putting gas in this thing and seeing if we can get it to actually start and run. check the oil that's good um, it's on full choke it's on the turtle and uh, we're ready to start it Time's a charm, huh?
So after I took the carb off, the carb was pretty gunked up. Um, I'm deciding that I'm going to replace the carb, even though it ran. Um, it was just in pretty rough shape. So for 17 bucks on Amazon, I found a carb, a spark plug, a new fuel line. Um, the fuel line that was on there completely broke. Um, I crimped it with the vice grips, and it completely just shattered in pieces, and it was rotten out. And um, I found an air filter as well. So. For 17 bucks, um, it's pretty cheap, and what I'm going to do is, next video, I'm going to install those parts and show you guys what to do. So, thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.